Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel Math Ways All Time Maths. If you haven't subscribed it yet, do not forget to subscribe it. Today we will learn how to rationalize denominator. We have to rationalize the denominator to get rid of the root values. So here you can see we have root 2 plus root 5 in the denominator place. We have to get rid of it. So for that we have to rationalize it. So let's start. 1 Divided by, we have to break it into two parts so that we can rationalize it. Four plus root two plus root five into four plus root two minus root five divided by four plus root two minus root five. What we have done here? We have just changed the sign from positive to negative. If it will be negative, you will change it to positive. So that we can use the formula here, a plus b into a minus b, which is equals to a square minus b square. So let's use the formula here. We'll get four plus root two bracket minus root five divided by four plus root two whole square, which is a square minus root five whole square, which is b square. Now here we will use the formula a plus b whole square, which is equals to a square plus b square plus two a b. Let me write down the equation here for your reference: four plus root two minus root five divided by four plus root two whole square minus root five whole square. So we will solve this one. Four plus root two whole square is equals to four square plus root two square plus two into four into root two, which is equals to sixteen plus two plus eight root two, which is equals to eighteen plus eight root two. We we'll write on here four plus root two minus root five. Divided by, we have already solved this part. We'll write down the answer: eighteen plus eight root two minus root five square means five. Now we'll solve this. We'll get here equals to four plus root two minus root five divided by eighteen minus five is thirteen plus eight root two. So after solving this part, we'll be getting this one. In this, you can see we have still root value in the denominator place. We have to again rationalize this equation. Four plus root two minus root five divided by thirteen plus eight root two. We have to change the sign. Thirteen minus eight root two divided by thirteen minus eight root two. We'll write down at the top into thirteen minus eight root two divided by. Now here again we'll use the same formula: a plus b into a minus b is equals to a square minus b square. So a is thirteen. We'll write down thirteen square. B is eight root two. It's square. Now we'll open the bracket here. Four into thirteen minus eight root two. Plus root two into thirteen minus eight root two minus root five thirteen minus eight root two. Do not miss any of the calculation here, otherwise your answer won't be right. Thirteen square. We'll write down one hundred and sixty-nine for this minus. Now eight root two whole square can be written as eight square root two. Square and in the middle, its dot means multiply. I have kept this equation for your reference, so we'll solve it further. Now we will multiply four into thirteen is fifty-two, minus four into eight root two is thirty-two root two, plus thirteen root two, minus eight root two into root two, minus thirteen root five. Plus eight root two into root five divided by 
169 minus 64 8 square root 2 is 2 which is equals to 52 minus 32 root 2 plus 13 root 2 minus root 2 into root 2 is 2 we'll write down 8 into 2 minus 13 root 5 plus root 2 into root 5 is root 10 i'm doing it step by step so that you will not get confused minus 128 now we'll solve it 52 minus 32 plus 13 we will solve it together because we have root 2 so 32 root 2 plus 13 root 2 will be equals to minus 19 root 2 minus 18 to 2 is 16 and rest will write down as such because we don't have similar root values in this question which is equals to now we will solve it 52 minus 16 if we will do you will get it equals to 36 minus 19 root 2 minus 13 root 5 plus 8 root 10 and 169 minus 128 will give you 41. I have shared a link in the description box for the worksheets. So do not forget to practice because practice makes us perfect. For more videos on such difficult questions, I will keep on sharing the videos. So do not forget to subscribe my channel, like the video and share with your friends.